Let's go to the full summary of chapter 1 level 11 17 of One Piece. So, loading. Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, and don't forget to leave your like, subscribe to the channel, and activate the bell so you don't miss anything. Well, let's get to the video. Chapter 1117 of One Piece has 17 pages, a relief since the previous chapter had only 13 pages. Chapter 1117 is titled Mo. In Japanese, the chapter title will be explained at the end of the summary. Ogre Child Yamato's Golden Harvest Surrogate Pilgrimage, Vol. 7. Yamato pays Nekomamushi and Hyoguro a visit in the flower capital. The chapter starts where the last one ended, and we see more reactions about Vegapunk's words all over the world. In Hachinosu, the pirate island, some pirates are eager to go search for treasures under the sea. Among them are Krieg, Gin, and Pearl. Krieg and Gin are walking among other pirates in the background of the panel, while Pearl is with the group that wants to search for treasures under the sea. Krieg now has long hair and is wearing part of his armor. We can see his shoulder plates with his Jolly Roger. Cut to Mont Blanc Cricket and the Saruyama Alliance, who are on their ship getting ready to dive and find more romance underwater. Cut to a marine hospital where sword members are resting. They are injured but don't look too bad. Kobe is lying on a bed but is conscious. Drake has also returned from Wano. Kujaku says he asked to be left alone so he's currently healing in a private room. Prince Gruss mentions that Vegapunk's message will lead to some very troubling conclusions. Kujaku replies to him, saying, It's our time to act now. Cut to Smoker, riding his billower bike on the sea. Smoker asks Tashigi via Denden Mushi where she is, and Tashigi replies that she's at the Marine Hospital. Vegapunk's message continues. Vegapunk says he's arriving at the final part of his message, as anything further would just be theories. The Frontier Dome Barrier is shut down, so Nami's group is ready to set sail. Jinbi and Zoro arrive, but suddenly Nusturo runs ahead of them towards the Thousand Sunny. Jinbi throws Zoro using a new technique called Fishman Jujutsu, Kataguruma. Fishman Jujutsu, Shoulder Wheel, and Zoro uses his attack, Nitoryu, Rashomon, to block Nusturo's attack. Zoro uses the swords Sandai Kitetsu and Enma to block Nushiro, causing black lightning and fire to appear when their swords clash. But Zoro notices something when he sees Nushiro's sword. Zoro says, Eh, a Kitetsu! Zoro and Nushiro are blown back by the impact. Jinbei grabs Zoro as Zoro shouts to Nami's group to take the Thousand Sunny off. Zoro says, Jinbei and I will jump on the ship later. Cut to Elbaf's ship, where many new giants are fighting against Marines. Vice Admirals arrive to join the fight. Bluegrass blows a hole in Elbaf's ship with a Sea Beast Weapon Beam. Dahl takes down Kashi using an attack called Rock and Roll Blaster. Luffy, back in normal form, Dory and Brogi are near the shore shouting for Elbaf's ship to take off, wondering where Warkiri has gone since he stopped chasing them. Saturn, Mars, Jupiter, and Warkiri are now surrounding the ancient giant robot. The Gorose realize it's the robot that attacked Mary Geoes 200 years ago. Vegapunk's message continues as the Gorosei say, Vegapunk, finally, I would like Mushiwara in their names. Warkiri says, why you? Characters with D in their names are connected. Kobe says Luffy San, Vice Admiral Garp, Marshal Deech, mm -hmm. Beepo says Captain. Vegapunk says, among you guys, there is Mo, Buzz, Buzz. Translator's note, Mo is the last Japanese character that appears before Vegapunk's message is cut off. And that character is the same as the one that appears in the chapter title. Suddenly, Warkiri's attack blows the ancient giant robot into the air, and it falls to the ground. Parts of the robot are damaged, but it remains intact. Warkiri says, Stop it already, Vegapunk. Vegapunk's signal suddenly disappears, shocking people around the world. Vivi and Morgans are also in shock. People say, Wah! It got cut off! Vivi says, what was he trying to say? Dit is, is something hindering the reception. In the final panel of the chapter, York falls to her knees. York says, huff, huff, it stopped. End of the chapter and no break next week. These were the spoilers for chapter 111, 117 of One Piece, the full summary. Remember that we will still have the chapter narrated and the review, so stay tuned to the channel.